Hi, my name is Jonathan Rollo and I'm the chef and owner of Greenleaf Gourmet Chop Shop. We're in my Hollywood kitchen today and I really want to make for you one of our great new dishes. It's called our Paleo Chicken Fajita Bowl. And like so many things, this is a really current topic. Eating clean, being paleo, um, really go hand in hand, which is part of what we do at Greenleaf. So basically it means nothing preservative, everything that you could um, gather, more or less, anything that would have been available in the Paleolithic era. And so we've combined a bunch of really great raw ingredients. Um, I am gonna cook two of them off. We're gonna combine them together and you're gonna see how it comes together for some awesome flavors. So to get started, I've got a uh, local source wild organic arugula that I'm gonna toss in a little bit of our skinny citrus lemon vinaigrette, which is a no sugar added olive oil based vinaigrette um, with just some great lemon zest. And so it packs a nice punch so it creates a really good base for this bowl. I'm gonna plate those greens just here in the middle. And then that's gonna be the basis. So then we're gonna move this down. And I'm gonna cook off these two items here. A little bit of extra virgin olive oil. This is from a local California farm here um, in Temecula, which I love. So they're, they are uh, totally organic. I'm gonna add the onions and peppers first. Get those started. And I'm gonna add our paleo rice, which is a combination of garlic, peas, and cauliflower. A little bit of paprika and cayenne pepper. I'm gonna let that fry up a little bit. And add the chicken to the fajita mix. Now the nice thing with the paleo diet is you can add a lot of different seasonings. Um, Himalayan salt, cayenne pepper, paprika, all these are gonna add a nice little bit of depth to the, to the dish. So I'm sprinkling on some Himalayan sea salt here, sorry, Himalayan rock salt. <laughs> and um, this will bring out a little bit of the flavors in addition to the cayenne and the paprika that I've got here. So we want that smokiness, we want that heat. Because in a fajita bowl, you wanna bring out those really great strong flavors. All right, so now I'm going to add this on top of the bowl here. So that's our paleo rice and our chicken fajita mix. I've taken a watermelon radish and I've saturated it with lemon juice to pickle it a little bit. So that helps soften it up. I'll go right on top. A nice slice of avocado to add a little bit of oil and, and creamy texture. And then I'm gonna take our chipotle nacho cheese sauce, which is a, um, olive oil blended with uh, chipotle mix and a little bit of cilantro right on top for a garnish and you have the green leaf totally paleo chicken fajita bowl